onside, Ryan Fraser. That went in. No, that fucking went in. All right, guys, make sure you're welcome back to Fraser's Glory. Oh my God. All right, boys and girls, we're going to be jumping into another squad builder today. I love it. In fact, it makes me really horny. Today's squad builder is around 50 to 40 ish K. When I originally built it, I'm pretty sure it cost me 50 K. But if I'm not mistaken, I think it's come down to about 40 K, which is obviously really good for you guys that are just starting out. It's a decent little starter team, boys. I'm pretty happy with it. So let's jump straight into it. Oh, 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 oh wow! Hey. Out. I'm sorry. Get the fuck out. I'm so Alright boys and girls, so let's start off in goal with Simon Mignolet. Obviously you guys could save some money and get the uh, the normal card, it's only 400 coins. But the inform is only 10,000 coins, so if you ever decide to sell this team, if you if you do pick it up, uh, you can literally discard him for the same price, so we've put the inform in. Alright boys and girls, let's get the worst part of the team out of the way, we do have a non-rare right back. What the fuck? He doesn't look half bad, okay, he has good physical, he has 84 pace, which is okay, decent defending and dribbling, but of course, you know, if you guys don't like non-rare, cards uh, he's non-rare and he's the only non-rare in the team which, which is a shame you can get any ivory coast right back here boys so if you have about an extra 20-ish k you could get the inform orier unfortunately orier's normal card is non-rare so we have the same problem if you decide to get his uh his normal card but the inform is only like 20-ish k maybe 30k he's pretty cheap so you could get orier's inform here at left back boys we've got this loddy card not a bad looking card similar to our right back to be honest with you he probably looks a little bit worse actually fuck you kid you're adopted again decent pace good defending and physical uh, and okay dribbling not a bad card at all center back boys we've got someone who's very overpowered i like this card a lot last year or at least his uh his team of season uh, we have mario hermoso as i said his team of season last year was incredible had 91 pace which is absolutely insane again decent defending decent physical really good pace uh just a solid solid center back here nothing nothing too crazy but boys his partner in crime and the reason i've picked up mignolet and this shit right back this center back here delhi is an absolute hidden gem you guys will be mad surprised by how good this card is he has me Medium high work rates, boys, and he's six foot four, so like insane start. Like I said, 650 coins. He, I literally won him on a bid. He goes to 700 coins. <laughs> Bear in mind, boys, he's six foot four, okay? Has 76 pace at, at that height, has 84 strength, really good defending. Like, if you put an anchor chem style on this card, you have an incredible B center back here. Like, he looks incredible for, for that cheap. But, boys, things get really juicy in the midfield and attack, boys, okay? Let's start off with Thomas Party on the left CDM here. Again, a really nice card. I think he has high, high work rates, if I'm not mistaken. Medium high work rates, so perfect centre mid right there. He's got a really balanced card, boys. Good pace, amazing physical, good defending, passing, shooting. Just an overall solid, solid midfielder. Right, CDM, boys, we have a card that you guys are probably aware of by now. He, he's very sweaty and surprisingly cheap. He's only about 2,000 coins, which shocks me, to be honest with you, because he's, he's EPL, he's got amazing stats. I, I thought he'd be a lot more expensive. But amazing pace on this card, boys. Amazing physical, good defending. I think he has medium high as well so yeah medium high work rates is good good got good T -t today junior good dribbling defending like he's literally got everything like this card is sick other than shooting of course uh i think party is party have good shooting i think he uh, actually not too bad 80 long shots is pretty good so party's probably a bit more all round than uh than gabamin is that his name gabamin but both really solid midfielders right there you can play either one of them at C uh, cdm like they they both look insane and to finish off the midfield boys we have oxley chamberlain not the craziest card in terms of defending but uh i think he'll be a really good box to box midfielder boys Okay, he has high high work rates, which is good. Four star, four star, again, really good. He has really good pace, which is, I'll be honest, is the main reason I wanted to get him. I want a nice fast midfielder. Fast midfielders, boys, are, are absolute must-haves this year. You can't be rocking out with slow midfielders. It just just doesn't work, in, in my opinion. Really, really good dribbling, no boys, like insane dribbling. Uh, he has decent shooting, because that's nothing great. Six nine finishing is not great, I must admit. But 76 long shots is pretty good. But the defending stats aren't terrible, boys. Like you'd be surprised by this. 70 standing tackle and 72 interceptions. You put an anchor chem style on Oxley Chamberlain with the high high work rates like he'll actually be pretty effective and the physical stats also not too bad 70 strength uh, stamina's not the best I will admit uh, it's, yeah that's not great fucking useless sack of shit 
Get out! But yeah, just overall really well-rounded card, boys. Like, nothing too incredible here, but I think he'll be really, really solid at centre mid. And then the front three, boys, where things get extremely, extremely sweaty. Starting off with Ryan Fraser, boys. He doesn't have the best shooting. It's not bad. 75 finishing is okay, but uh, it, he's got amazing dri dribbling stats, like 95 agility, 90 pace on that. Like, this is a this is a pretty sweaty card. I'm going to be playing him in the cam position. He is sadly only a three-star skiller, which is obviously not great for some of you guys. But other than that, what a card this is. 95 agility and 90 pace. That's going to be fun at fucking cam, okay? Right wing position, boys, we have Richarlison. Uh, he, I think, yeah, five-star weak foot again this year. So that's going to come in clutch. He's a four-star skiller. So uh, if you guys do skills, that's all good. In all honesty, I, I feel like Richarlison deserves a better card. See, a lot of people agree and say that Richarlison deserves a much better card than 79 rated. But... For a 79 rated card, it's not bad at all, okay? He's got 81 finishing, which is, is pretty... I'd say that's fair. Like, 81 finishing is, is a pretty solid stat. His pace should definitely be higher, but 84 pace is still not bad. If you put a Hunter Chem style on him, like, he'd be very, very fast. And his dribbling stats are also really good. Not the craziest agility, but 84 in-game is really nice. He has really good physical stats as well with 77 strength. Decent stamina. It's not the craziest, but it's okay. But yeah, just an overall really good card, especially when you bear in mind the 5-star the five star weak foot. I wish his pace was a bit higher. I feel like he definitely does deserves that. Uh, but yeah, the shooting stats are really good. Uh, and yeah, just an overall really good card, to be honest. And to finish up the squad builder, boys, we have my favourite card, at least in my opinion. Okay, Callum Wilson. The, everyone's rocking out with Callum Wilson. I've seen him in so many sweaty starter teams. What a card this guy is, okay? Starting things off, boys, you've got four star skill moves. So again, you do your skill moves, you're going to enjoy that. He is sadly only three star weak foot, so that is my least favourite part of the card, in my opinion. Shit weak foot, it makes him a little bit less appealing. Other than that, it's a sick card. He's got really nice pace, boys. 83 finishing, which is really good. Uh, he's got okay dribbling. It's not the best. Uh, I would say an engine chem style might be, might be a good go here, like... It could help him quite a lot. And again, just like Richarlison, he's got really good physical stats, boys. 75 strength, really nice. Not the cra not the crazy stamina again. This does seem to be a reoccurring theme. Yo, kill me with this! But just overall, this card is just dripping with sweat, boys. Like, it's it's kind of filthy, I'm not going to lie. 83 finishing at the start of the game, is, is that's good, okay? So, boys, what we're going to do with this team, okay? We're going to be playing a 4 one 2 one 2 I'm going to be playing Gabamin at CDM, uh, but uh, honestly, Party could easily play CDM. They're both uh, equally as good, however... Party has slightly better shooting stats. I think he's also a four-star weak foot, if I'm not mistaken. He's only a three-star weak foot, my bad. But still, decent shooting stats on, on Thomas Party. So I'm going to play him at centre mid instead of Gabami. We're going to have Ox at right centre mid, boys. Ryan Fraser will play the cam position, and then Richarlison and Callum Wilson are up top. I must confess, boys, I have played a few games with this team. Uh, I wanted to try out that Delhi centre uh, center back. Uh, I wanted to try Callum Wilson. I tried a few games in squad battles, and I tried a few games online. Uh, I'll be honest, it performed better in the online games it did in the in the squad battles for some reason i was struggling a little bit in squad battles i'm not gonna lie like it it, it was winning but it wasn't winning that good i was winning like 2-1 uh you know free free two on on like world class difficulty which i uh, kind of surprised me online it, it was smashing people I, I was destroying people online with this team Ooh. So hopefully we can do the same today, boys. Uh, I have been playing a little bit better, I must admit. Like the last video, I think I did well. Um, and I recorded the SCN video, which obviously has not been released yet. I was playing awful in that in that video, I think. I think I only won one game out of three in that review, so not the best performance in the SEM review that you guys will see uh, probably even in the next episode. One of you guys told me in the comments uh, to hold down L2 when defending. That tip helped me out so much, so whoever, whoever sent that comment, thank you very much because I, it, it hasn't made me that much better. But it's improved my defending quite considerably. I'm a lot better than I was. Like, you guys saw how bad I was defensively. I can at least defend a little bit now. So, uh, thanks to that guy, because he, he helped me a lot with that. Holding L2, if you guys don't know, it kind of makes your players a bit more stable. So, they can they can kind of jockey a little bit. So, if you don't know, hold down L2. Or, you know, try it a bit with your defenders. It helps a lot. Anyway, enough babbling, boys. Let's just jump into a couple of games with the team. Uh, like I said, it is pretty decent. So, if you guys want to pick it up, it's about 40,000 coins which I think is a really good price. Anyway, let's jump into game number one. Oh, nice pass. Come on, make no run. Richarlison, onside. Brilliant pass. Easy finish. Come on. You didn't take the laptop, did you? Huh? You didn't take the laptop? No. You filmed? Yeah. You get the hell out! Richarlison making runs. Great through pass. Come on, Richarlison, use your pace. Easy finish. 
Oh, Richarlison's on fire. I loved him last year, especially his putties. His putties was incredible. His normal card is doing, he's doing bits. What a pass, onside, I'm pretty positive. Options, boys. I'm seeing Richarlison out here. That's a great pass where I didn't intend it. What a, f is that Richarlison hat trick? No, 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 no. Oh, it's Ox. Great finish from the Ox. I'll probably bottle it, boys, all right? I'll just prepare for a bottle job here, okay? It's gonna happen. Lovely, yeah. Nice. Come on. Oh, Fraser, come on. Finish the game off. No bottle jobs today. Fraser, we've got to finish that. Yes. Yes. One more. Hit it. Oh, good save. Richarlison, I've got options. Oh, brilliant back heel. Kill him. Um, what the fuck? Oh, no, read it. Richarlison. Finesse. Oh, come on. Oxy came from distance. Jesus Christ. All right, that's it, though. That's it. Right, we've won. No bottle shoves. That's good to see, boys. We like to see it. So, yeah, boys. Overall, fantastic performance. Richarlison scoring a double with really nice goals. He should have scored a hat trick. I think he hit the bar, so should have definitely got a hat trick. Alan Wilson played pretty good. I don't think he scored. He didn't, but did he get? He got an assist, so he had a good game. He was he was unlucky. I think he probably should have scored at least one. Oxley Chamberlain, fantastic performance from the lad. Uh, got a great finish. Uh, was just overall up and down the pitch, getting tackled. Dribbles, he, he was absolutely brilliant. I probably didn't show too many highlights, if any, but Delhi centre back was absolutely. He made how many tackles did he make? What? That's bullshit. He made at least like five to six tackles. Like that is a complete lie. So yeah, great performance from the boys. If we can just keep this up, uh, then obviously like I, I'm actually showing some improvement on FIFA if I can keep this going. But yeah, overall team is performing great. So let's jump into game number two. Blistering pace from Ox. Absolutely blistering. Sweat it across. I've brought it back to Fraser. Fraser! Brilliant! Oh, Ryan Fraser! Get in there, lads. I'm loving the team. Oh, great pass. Love it. Richarlison. First. Come on, and Callum Wilson's up. Callum Wilson for his first goal of the FP. You know he's burying it with that 83 finishing. Phenomenal performance so far, boys. <laughs> Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Come on, Callum Wilson. Let's see him runs. Drop it back. Easy party. Oh, you just got to love it. you got to love everything about the team. The finishing is great. Look at that from party. The run's good. The pace. Just absolutely brilliant. 3-0 up again. <laughs> yeah, boy. Brilliant. Oxy chain. Come on. Sweat it. Come on, how have you saved that? Lovely bit of football. Onside, Ryan Fraser. That went in. No, that fucking went in! <laughs> Oxy chain. What a through pass. Callum Wilson play Richarlison in. Richarlison. Oh, he slid in. Option, sweat it. No to Fraser! Over the top. Did he just scorpion kick that back to the fucking... Uh -huh. There you go, boys. Another great performance from the lads. Uh, who got the goals this time? Fraser, Party, and Callum Wilson. No goals for Richarlison. He played good, though, Richarlison. Oxley chamberlain again. They scored in the first game, Oxlade and, and Richarlison, and then everyone else scored in this game. So you can't you can't complain from the performance. Like, the, honestly, like we've been playing pretty sick. Two clean sheets so far. Delhi and Hermoso, partnership of dreams. They've been phenomenal at the back. kabamin has been an absolute brick wall in front of that defence. Um, you know, Party and Chamberlain up and down the field. Fraser running and just past defenders left and right. Callum Wilson's been phenomenal. Guys, this team has been amazing. If you've got 40 to 50-ish K, like you don't have enough for a mega team, this team right here has just been phenomenal for me. So give it a try. Like It's been so sick. With that being said, though, we are going to jump into one more game, boys. You know, I'm feeling nice. I'm feeling like a free game, free game uh, sesh today. So let's just jump straight into game number three. If I lose... If I lose, I'm going to be actually devastated because we've had two great... I could have ended on two fantastic forms. We better we better win, all right? We better fucking... <laughs> oh, come on. That's my first goal. That's actually the first goal we concede of the epi. That. Oh, that's a good pass. He's going to score. Oh, fucking, he's done me. Oh, God. Oh, God, we're really finished. We're actually really finished. 
We're really, we're, we're done. We're done out here, bros. Brilliant ball. Fraser. Into Ox. Come on, we've opened him up. This is our chance. This is our chance! Oxy chain! Over the top. Brilliant pass. Play across. Brilliant pass. Oxy chain on the right foot. Are you fucking... What was that? Oh, come on. Oh, what a pass. Alright, options, boys. Options. Yes. Yes. Yes! One more! Oh, the f- No! Get the big kill right in the- Fuck! Fuck! Great through pass. Come on. Consolation. Callum Wilson. Oh, we deserved it, man. Honestly, I feel like we deserved a draw here. Like, we actually played pretty good. We started so poorly. When that... Come on, one more. Shoot. Oh, it's good, we actually started this game so badly, but had we started all right and put our chances away, we, we would easily have won that. So yeah, overall, boys, I really enjoyed the team. I thought it was absolutely phenomenal. Uh, th this game, we were unlucky. I thought we started, like I said, really badly, but we, we grew into the game and uh, we just I just missed a few chances and it just things weren't going our way, to be honest. Game one and two, boys, without a doubt, like you guys saw, two clean sheets from me, of all people. Like You don't see it often, especially this FIFA. I've been dreadful defensively, so you you know this team defensively is good. Okay, Delhi and Hamoso were outrageous. Gabamin is an amazing CDM. Uh, Party and Ox were making good tackles in the midfield. Uh, it just defensively was fantastic. I thought Richarlison was great. Fraser was amazing. His agility felt really, really good. He was really good on the ball. Callum Wilson was was absolutely phenomenal. Just overall, absolutely loved everyone. But boys, that is concluded today's episode of the Race Glory. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, smash like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, peace.